Rated holidays in the Hispanic community as Dia de los Muertos. And although it's celebrated in November, the Arts Council of Midland decided to celebrate it early. CBS 7's Noe Ortega was at the Arts Council and he has more. Noe. Well, starting today, the Arts Council of Midland will have its first ever Dia de los Muertos exhibit where artists made woodworks, sculptures and paintings dedicated towards the Day of the Dead. Colorful skulls, skeletons with hats and iconic Hispanic figures. Many of the artists use this day to honor friends and family that they've lost. With the large Hispanic population, the Arts Council of Midland aims to make sure artists can express themselves. I think it's very meaningful for um, the people that do this artwork, that create these altars. Um, it's also meaningful if you take a time to look at them and if it's not your culture, maybe to understand what these artists are expressing. Dia de los Muertos started off as a holiday to honor the ancestors who passed, a tradition that Spaniards brought to Mexico that was a month-long celebration before it turned into a two-day celebration. With skeletons as the main focus but wearing clothes like charros and painted faces, but these artists capture the tradition in a more modern way. There's some references to that in some of the artwork, but it does look different and kind of fresh and new, the way they've handled it. Oliva says it's a good way for people in the area to meet up and coming artists and share experiences. It's a little different than like a museum setting. You can come and I can say, oh, is this your painting? And then you can start to talk to that person more about what it really meant to them while they were doing it. If you would like more information on this event, you could visit our website at CBS7.com. In Midland, I'm Noir Ortega, CBS7 First Alert News.